Freezing rain leaving New Hampshire's road and walkways slick and icy on Christmas night. Sheet of ice, yeah, we couldn't even drive around. It was all ice, glare ice. We had a bunch of people coming around the corner and hitting the snow banks. We caught up with Curtis in Laconia while he was shoveling his driveway, trying to keep things clear for post-holiday travels. It's been pretty messy all day, yeah. So I'm just trying to clean it up now. And Get it taken care of before morning, before it freezes. Elsewhere across town, plow crews clearing slush and salting roads. This morning was bad. It was all ice. And they weren't really treating. They've been treating pretty well, so and temperatures got to the point where it's melting, so we're doing pretty good. Today's a particularly difficult day to travel with the air temperature, the road temperature, and then that freezing rain coming in. It froze on contact. The New Hampshire Department of Transportation says their crews have been working around the clock this holiday. The day went on and temperatures um, rose slightly and we also had time for the salt that we had applied to work. Uh, those roadways did clear um, as the day went on. And they'll continue working into Sunday morning. We for, are not heading home for the foreseeable future. We'll be out because the storm will continue. And for a while, the DOT had many of the interstates and turnpikes downposted. Their speed limits were at 45 miles an hour, although at this point, many of those are back up to 65 miles an hour. But the DOT is still warning drivers to take it slow if you're hitting the roads tonight. We're live in Manchester. Scott Cook, WMUR News 9.